Let's go to our reporter Maya Burry live in Christchurch because we began the program talking about the Heathcote River and the possibility it was going to flood again into homes along uh, the river in the kind of Woolston or Power area. Maya, where are you? Are you on the riverbank somewhere there? Yeah, I'm, I'm right by the Heathcote River, John. I'm standing uh, right by Clarendon Terrace, which is uh, by the river and has been closed since this afternoon due to the flooding. And yeah, the river is very high. You can see it's um, starting to spill onto parts of the road here. And this was what the City Council was expecting. And this is why the state of emergency has been declared essentially. So people have time to, um, you know, prepare to, to self-evacuate if required. You know, uh, they are expecting things to, to get worse tonight. The, the worst of the storm is expected to hit between five o'clock this evening and one o'clock in the morning. And the rain's really starting to come down heavy now. Oh, so it, it sounds like it is setting in. OK, so the homes that were flooded, the poor buggers, some of them, what, three weeks ago, and many of them, I think, uh, 30 seriously and 27, some foundation flooding last July. They're just going to cop it again, are they, Maya? Yeah, that looks like it's going to be the case. The, the Mayor Leanne Dazelle did say that no one has um, been forced, there's no forced evacuations yet, but a lot of people who've been through this before and, and know how horrible it is have, yeah, have chosen to self-evacuate. And uh, a welfare centre's been set up at Pioneer Stadium for, for anyone who, who doesn't have a, a place to go while they wait this out. But uh, a lot of people are also staying with, you know, friends and family. They've been through this before. And so, yeah, they're just preparing for the worst, essentially. And another area of concern is that the Banks Peninsula, where we're expecting really strong uh, wind and rain. And, and those residents in that area were, you know, told, advised to go home early from work today. And just, you know, uh, it's quite a rural area. So, you know, move stock from low-lying areas if required, that kind of thing. Maya Bari live from the Heathcote River.